Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Stick It To The Man and currently we're in the Nightmare Stage 8. I don't quite remember this stage all that well, but it should be surmountable. <laughs> wow! Someone had too big of an ego and too much time on their hands. Oh, and also a big rock. Ray! Ray, you've got to help me! Ray! Hey, it's that little dude from last time. How's it going, little guy? Ray, please help! <laughs> You're so high-spirited. I think I'll call you a name that reflects your energetic ways. Um, maybe... Ted? That's my name. That's the spirit. Ray, follow me. It's your only hope. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much just that. Follow it, and don't stop. If you do, you're gonna have problems. I like I messed up there by not jumping. This is your- well, I was, uh... It would be nice to have a little bit of a... You know, warning before we get to the big jumps, but okay, fine, whatever. I guess I gotta just deal with it. I'm gonna jump at just the wrong time, aren't I? Oh, I thought I was. Well, Keep your distance from them. that'd be nice if you could tell me when to jump, because I barely got through it. This is just basically a speed run, if you have, basically a test to see if you've mastered the mechanics of running yet, I think. So just don't mess up is pretty much the order of the day here. Oh, don't go that way. Almost went the wrong way. That would have been embarrassing. Here's the way out. Don't let them touch you, Ray. Run faster. Okay, that was not that was informative. Alright, oh, that that's not gonna get anything done. It's just gibberish essentially. And wasting time. Which we don't really have the luxury of here. I think right now we do, because I'm not really being chased, but I'm just gonna say that we are. I don't remember this stage being that long, though. Oh my. That's a big goon. And I think he's closing the gap. Come on, just a little more. You know, I wish these camera transitions were a little smoother, game. That'd be nice. Follow me, Ray. Oh, jeez. Like that. I nearly just walked right into him. If you zoomed out a little bit, it would have been a little easier. Oh, this will be fun. Oh, well, I was trying as hard as I could. I thought I'd failed there because it just did not register. <laughs> I don't like how creepy this has become. You dummy. You ran right to where I want you. This is almost too easy. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Come on, wake up. Wake up, buddy. I need your help. Okay, I guess we're doing two chapters because we're not doing like a four-minute run. The Man Cave. I'm in a man cave right now. I love it. It's of my own design, though, as opposed to this. This is your last chance. Come out, or we'll force you out. Uh, huh? I'd listen to him. If you don't do what he says, then he'll have failed at his job. And I'll have to eliminate him. And then, it'll be just us here. You don't want to be alone with me. Ah! Oh, jeez! Increase power to 11. It only goes to 10. I'm turning as hard as I can! I'm interested in results, Agent, not excuses. Did you not read my design document? This is not supposed to happen. Fix it, or I fix you, Agent. Right. Well, let's get started. Pretty obvious what you should do there. You're fired. Everyone who is involved in this happening to me is fired. I'll help you, sir. Don't fire me. It's a rough economy for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
Hey, man. Glad we could finally meet in real life. Oh, you, you're like a slug. There's no time to talk about how hot my body is right now. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Our first order of business is to find Arlene. I'm sure she's alive. Let's go. Hey, up top, Ted. I don't know how the physics of that works. We're just gonna go with it. This has been a difficult day. Do I get paid overtime for this? Ugh, I wonder what Brad's making. about how she's held in Omega Sector 33. Ooh, darn it. I need to think about something else. Not how Arlene's in Omega Sector. Ooh, darn it. Okay, man, you've got this. Just think about something else. I, I don't know. Ponies. Ponies, ponies, ponies. Hey, I wonder if there's any ponies in Omega Sector 33. Ooh, which is also where Arlene... Oh, darn. Well, now that we know where Arlene is, which I don't think you actually have to do that, now we know where she is, we know what our objective is. I kind of wish that that other place was quite a bit longer because I remember this being a little heavy on puzzles. Are you the new supervisor? I, um, yes, uh, carry on. Is it just me or does this look like something completely unsavory is going on? I think I saw just saw a zombie. Please don't ask about the beach from last week. Please don't ask about the beach from last week. I wish I could ask about the breach, just to make this man nervous. Then again, I'm a terrible person. Come on, I was... Oh, I had to put something up there. Right. It's like, I want that camera! Oh. You know, he is pretty cute. <laughs> Too bad he's already dead. I could never bring a zombie home to mom and dad. You've got zombie racisms. I... love... teacher. Teacher, pretty, teacher, nice, want, give teacher presents. That's nice. Young love is going to be happening and we're going to help facilitate it because we're nice people. I don't remember how we do it, but I remember we have to help them at some point or another. I also remember there's a pretty funny scene in this area. I just hope I remember where it is. From the top, guys. Of course. I end up being a zombie and my brother gets off scot-free. Of course. Oh, I'm gonna eat his brain so hard. Two things considered, I think I probably should have kept my nursing job. I don't think this choir pays as well. Also, I'm a zombie, so there's that too. Five uh, I lose my days. Now? I lose my life and become a zombie? Oh well, I will put my feelings in the song. I'm 99% certain that if we can get this down, the General Handsome might be impressed with me. Who would have thought that such a handsome general would have such an appropriate last name? If he'd been a doctor, he'd be Dr. Handsome. Nice! 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 Okay, from the top guys. Yes, Doctor, or not Doctor, General Handsome is at the forefront of that scene I was talking about just a minute ago. And I don't think I really have to go down there quite yet, but I'm gonna see if they give me sleep here. Yes, they do. I guess I probably should have listened to that, but I just did not feel like doing so. That's not what I wanted to do, but I guess that will work. I may have screwed up royally here. Yeah, I've screwed up royally here, because there's no way out. This is where the puzzles start coming into play that I am just not that good at. So this might take a little while. I gotta figure out the optimal way of going through this. And hello, nurse. Just gotta get that guy over there, there we go. And sneak down this way. I think. Aha! Now we're cooking with gas. Probably should have looked in the thing before I set him free, though. That's mine. You don't need that anymore. Oh man, what am I gonna do now? Uh, 
suppose I could take up beatboxing. My bad. My bad. Yes, Mr. Elvis Impersonator, it was. It was that bad. I don't remember what we need the guitar for, but... I wonder who else I know who can play guitar. Not me. When I play guitar, it sounds like 18 cats dying. And then their corpses trying to play guitar. Me too, Ray. Me too. Don't feel too bad. Some of us just don't have that musical talent. I have to go up now. Oh my goodness. If it was hard getting down, it's harder going back up. I remember this because I had a lot of trouble getting back up, I think. Oh good, they, they don't even get me. Oh, I guess I can just go up this way. I was gonna say, oh good, they don't even get me sleep. That's, that's great. So I guess I just gotta brute force this mess. It worked. I... Not generally the way you're supposed to go about doing it, but it works. I guess I'll try going right now. Um, aren't you the dude? Are you like his brother? I was the one born with the singing talent. Him because he made it to the radio first. I could show them what real rock and roll sounds like. Well, let's help him out. Let's help him prove himself. Finally, a guitar. Yeah, I'm taking that. You don't need a mouth. Mouth of Elvis. Right. I don't think you're supposed to give it to the other guy, so. If we are, whoops. Do I want to know why I, why I can inter interact with the toilet? Well, it was worth a shot. I don't think I probably really want to. Ha, ha, ha. This whole thing is a setup. I was shot down by the government because I wouldn't let them build a military base on the North Pole. I'm not destroying the economy, I said. I'm just giving toys to all the good little girls and boys. But no, they shoot me down and lock me up here. Naughty, naughty, naughty. I could only get Rudolph back. I could escape and take my revenge. Ho, 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 no. Well, considering I'm... You gotta love the political commentary they just throw in the game for really no reason. But it is a fun little easter egg. So that's Santa Claus over there. I still need to find a way to go further right. Which... Pretty sure there is a way of doing that, I just don't know what it is. All I have is the mouth of Elvis and this guy does not want it. So... Backtracking ahoy, it seems like. So... Wait a minute. Is that a shotgun? Wrong sticker. Uh, that won't oh, I know stick. what this—I know what the mouth of Elvis is for. I just—I don't think I'm anywhere near that yet, uh, so there's no point. Stick. No, I don't think there's any point in getting or like having got it this early. That sexy god will never love me like this with my big old bald spot, <laughs> my broken heart. <laughs> I suppose that's a female Bigfoot, I, I guess. I don't, I, or whatever that is, Yeti. Why does everyone want to get so close to my door? It's just a regular old door. Oh, I can see why they hired me. People are always trying to make their way through my rad door. And yes, that's a hint that these two are connected. You have to get that whole thing set up. And, oops, I think I went the wrong way. Eh, what's this? A chimney. Ah, chimneys. Whoops. Ah, chimneys. Every house is a house with rooftop access when you've got a chimney. Yeah, but for the life of me, I don't remember why we want that. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought that was a megaphone. That's a, that's a camera. Whoops. That's important to note for later. You want the, you want to put the mouth of Elvis, I think, on a megaphone or like the, uh, what do you call that? I don't know what you call them, but we don't want to go back here. There's no reason to go back there yet. Actually, I don't think there's a reason to go back there ever. So I've had to have seen what I need to do. I'm just not putting it together yet. I tend to do that a lot. Well, it was worth a shot. Well, 
It was worth a shot. So really, it's just a matter of try everything. I don't think the chim... Yeah, that'd be a hell of a hat. No, I didn't think it would work. Wrong sticker. So we're back to the try everything method. It's fun. It's just tedious at times. Because I'm pretty sure you don't need any of these. No. That won't stick. Just wanted to make sure, though. So, let's either go downstairs where the... Well, I guess I, that's an idea. It's the only idea I have so far. Oh, wait. Okay. One of these guys probably needs the mouth. No, 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 no. This is entirely wrong. Ah, the only way to deal with this is to pull out my own hair. Well, that's one way of dealing with your problems, I guess. Not exactly a great solution, but now we have the hair, which obviously goes to the Yeti or whatever that creature was up there. I am not a master of just, you know, figuring out what you call things. I just know what to do with them. Uh, my bald spot! It's fixed! I'm fixed! Oh, I'm coming for you, my love! Whoa. And there you go. I'm actually proceeding through this a lot quicker than I ever imagined I would, to be honest. My family is totally going to wonder why I'm late for dinner. Oh, happiness. This is what love feels like. I don't want to know what she's planning. Probably something illegal, if I had to guess. I mean... She doesn't strike me as the civilized type. She's probably going to take what she wants. And we all know what she wants. Oh, God. Did not really think that through at all. But it will work. Even if it shouldn't. Ever. Okay, I really just thought I could make that jump. I didn't see the wall. <laughs> that was stupid, I'll admit. I just did not see that wall. That's all that was. So now I gotta actually think about how to go about doing this. Because while well, yes, I can just go up here and then... I need to get down there. Crap. Oh dear, well here we go again. I think I just did not do this quick enough before. I think was the problem. Well he's gonna come all the way over here. Okay. No, no. Give me that. There we go. Need that. And now all I gotta do is... Preferably find the other guy, stick this on his face, make that guy leave, and then... Well, actually, I guess I just need to do this. Actually, that was the directly wrong thing to do. That was the objectively wrong thing to do, because that was stupid. Really just plain stupid. Please note... If you're actually intelligent, this is not actually difficult. Just gonna throw that out there. No. Just need to slap it on... That dude. That was ballsy, and I got away with it. I don't think I should have gotten away with it, but I did. You're supposed to actually sneak past them, not just run by in the melee. There we go. Move on over. Making progress. 